Tracy's identity was stolen by a Wells Fargo employee. Charles's car was illegally repossessed while he was serving our country in Iraq. Amber's lender harassed her over student debt she didn't owe. But all three were blocked from taking these lawbreakers to court, thanks to a rip-off clause hidden in the fine print. Big companies like Equifax and Wells Fargo use these clauses as a get-out-of-jail-free card when they break the law. They force consumers into secret arbitration, where we end up paying them nearly $8,000 on average. But as Americans get squeezed by Wall Street scammers, Congress wants to repeal protections that rein in these rip-off clauses. Tell your senator to fight for consumers, not Equifax and Wells Fargo. No on SJ Res 47.